Hi, welcome to a type of video I haven't done in a minute. There, it's very echoey in this room. It's the first time I've, I think I filmed in this room. It's very echoey. I did not realize that. Also, I don't want to do my hair today. Oh, right. Shark Tank products. I haven't tested Shark Tank products in a minute. And I found some good ones. And these ones were a little pricey, if you ask me. All right, we have the Snacked IV. The Snacked. Snackative. The Snackative. Snackative? Is that how you... How you do it? It's like chopsticks you put on your fingers so you can eat snacks without getting your fingers all gross. And like when you're working and stuff. Obviously we have to try that. Wad free. This is, you put this on the ends of your sheets when you wash them and it makes it so they don't get tangled and twisted and balled up in your laundry. Cause you know how like you have to run like the fitted sheet, you have to run it like six times in the dryer cause it keeps just balling up on itself. Apparently this keeps it from doing that. So I have to do laundry today. Um, they also sent me a little thing saying, thank you for supporting their small business. Cute. I'm excited for this one. This is called Hug Sleep. Apparently it's a giant cocoon for adults when they go to sleep. And I want to try it. It's like a sheet sleeping bag. So it doesn't get you all warm like a sleeping bag, but it's like you're being hugged. I don't know, I love hugs. I'm constantly craving hugs. So if I get it from an inanimate object instead of bugging human beings, great. And then lastly, this was expensive and had terrible ratings on Amazon, but Shark Tank said it was like the product. I almost dropped it on myself. The Vabroomy. Wait, is it the Vabroom? The Vabroomy? Is that just an exclamation? Is it the Vabroom? Or the Vabroomy? The Vabroom? I have no idea. That is a terrible logo. I have no idea if it's the Vabroom or the Vabroomy. <laughs> It's a sweeper with a built-in vacuum machine. So you can sweep up your mess and then turn on the little vacuum machine and it sucks up the pile so you don't have to get out the dust pan and like do this a bunch while the line just never goes away. You sweep and have to go back and sweep and have to go back and sweep. So yeah, no more bus dust pans and no more bending over. What if I wanna bend over? What? So we're gonna test those in no particular order. Let's see what I get my butt to doing first. Okay. <laughs> what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm just gonna do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. Oh yeah, this room is just absolutely filthy. I don't think I've ever cleaned this room. Can you see my pile? <laughs> I'm just getting my pile here, hold on. It's working as a normal broom. We have, oh, just the camera. We have normal broom functions. I'm gonna put all this into a little pile. Okay, and we're gonna get a close up of it, vacuuming it up. Here's my pile, do you see the dirt? Now apparently, <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, well, actually, the suction is very low. I really happened to get in there multiple times. I mean, no, I, I'm, hold on. It's scraping the rubber off of this. It's scraping that rubber off onto the floor. Then I'm having a vacuum up its own rubber. What is going on? Well, it did suck up some of that. Let's see how easy this is to get out. How does, how does this work? What is the point? Okay. And then I just dump that. And this is, this is what I dump. I just dump this. All right. It does suck up, but the suction is very low. Like it is a very soft, suckage. It's better than nothing, but it's got some flaws. I think the suckage could be a lot stronger, but I do feel like I was still getting down there. And like, you're not supposed to have to bend over anymore, but I just feel like I'm still down there to make sure it sucked everything up. Like that is, that's a low suction. I mean, I've personally just used a vacuum instead of a broom for many years now. Like I just don't use a broom because you can get a vacuum that has carpet, rug, and hardwood floor settings. And then like, I feel like that does so much more than a broom. Like you're getting everything with the, with the vacuum. So to, I, I'm gonna say this isn't worth it. I would say just get a vacuum and vacuum your floors, but that's just me. Next product. I need a hug. Why is the lighting wrong? Lighting is better and I still need a hug, darn it. Um, I think I'm supposed to put pajamas on with this. I don't feel like I should get on this with my normal street clothes. I'm from the street. 
But first I wanna just lay this out and see what's up. This is like mermaid status kind of thing happening. Do they have a thing where your feet can come out or is this where my head goes? Where does my head go? This is a medium if anyone wants to know. Are there instructions on how to get a hug? Take your time, it can take a few nights to adjust your sleeping habits. We recommend using Sleep Pod for five to seven nights to become fully acclimated. How to use while in bed, slip inside Sleep Pod so that the top seam is at a comfortable height. We recommend starting near your upper chest and working up to above your shoulders for your feet. Sleep pod can be used with your feet inside or out. Oh, so this is the feet part. Okay, that makes sense. It's like a little hood. All right, I'm gonna get in pajamas because I wanna fully experience this. So I'm gonna get in this. Not wearing socks to bed because I'm not an animal. Okay. Feel like I have died. <laughs> And I'm just in a little cocoon. I kinda wanna see what it's like. This is gonna be suffocating. I'm a swaddled little baby. <laughs> oh, it's really easy to get your feet out. Oh, that's that's nice. It's really easy to do the feet thing. Cause I was like, oh, if you're all tucked in and then you want your feet out, you're gonna like kick and flop. No, it's very easy. Feet out, feet in. Oh, that's, that's pretty. podcast um, so that she feels nestled in this just, yeah I like this I mean my only quorum is that a word is that I need a pillow between my legs to sleep can I still pill you you can still pillow don't worry you can still pillow between your no you can use to keep your jaw shut oh okay that's it for this video I mean to take a nap now now I know there's gonna be nights when you need to stretch out, and I understand that. But for those nights you need to be cocooned. I love this. This is a good Shark Tank. I don't wanna get out, it's so cozy in here. This is a good Shark Tank product. I say yes to this, and also it doubles as a mermaid. Okay, I need to do the rest of this video. <laughs> okay, I just had to watch an instructional video, instructional video on how to do these wad freeze. I learned, so let me explain to you, because it was a lot. So you strip your bed. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, I hate doing the bed. So you gotta take everything off the bed that you're not washing. Here it is, okay. Now, you take the four corners of your sheet, you use one wad on each sheet. So, here we go, I'm doing it. You got these things, you have to unhook these. Take a corner. <laughs> so you put it near the corner, then you slide down. Oh, hold on. The other girl who did it has been doing it forever. She invented it. It's hard, see, it's too hard for me. There we go, and you do that for all four corners. Okay, it's not that difficult once you get the hang of it. It is a little extra work, but that way, hopefully you don't have to wash your clothes or dry your clothes, like put it through like 10 different cycles because it can't dry. There we go. That's the sheet. It's like a giant parachute. Now you do, okay, my girlfriend's side is very dirty. She has got, all right. And then you do the same for the other side. Take the sheet up, grab this. So I put the elastic through it. Here we go. Slide. Boom. Do it on all four corners. Okay, I'm gonna go load this in the washing machine. They say make sure you're loading one at a time so they're not like bunched together when you put them in the washing machine. So I'm gonna go do that and then we'll take them out and see if they bundled and then we'll put them in the dryer and then take them out of the dryer and do the whole, you know, like washing a bed. So we'll do that. And tell my girlfriend what I was doing. And so she switched the laundry just because she's a really nice person. And I was like, oh, she started washing the bed. I will help. She put the sheets in the dryer. Moment of truth. Did they get tangled? Ladies and gentlemen, they are all dry and not tangled. It works. This fully works. Ah, wad free. Like without a doubt, this, this works. Complete. I love it. 
fantastic. There's no doubt. There's no doubt. This fully works. They aren't like uh, wrapped together in each other or in themselves. Brilliant. <sighs> All right, last thing we're testing. The snack tip. The snack tip. The snack tip. Okay, most times they show this off with uh, Cheetos, but I don't eat Cheetos. So we're just gonna use pretzels because any snack is a snack, right? Okay. Oh, I thought it was gonna be like harder to control. It's not. So this is, so when you're sitting at the desk, working away, we can grab a snack and keep working. Let's see. I love food. Okay. So we're sitting at the desk and we're working, right? We have my bag of chips here. Let's act like I have a very important document to write. Well, might as well eat while I'm waiting for my document to get pulled up. All right, hold on. Okay. To whom it may, I spelled everything wrong. To whom it may concern. I am the most beautiful person on earth. I thought everyone should be on the same page about that, period. I need a pretzel. Here we go. Fingers did not get gross. This works. This works. You can fully type. It says you can also use your phone. Hold on. So this is so, when you're using your electronics, you're working or whatever, your fingers don't get gross. And you can just do this. Uh-huh. This is genius. Man, the products today have been really good except the vacuum. This is really good. It works. I love it. I'm gonna say this is great. And then you get a little finger workout. Because who works out their fingers like this? You work out your fingers like this. So this is a whole new level of workout. And it comes in different colors and it fits on any fingers. I love this. It's perfect. This product is a win. Man, this has been great. All right, that's gonna be it for today. Why is my tripod falling? <laughs> happening. All right, that's gonna be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. These were actually some really great Shark Tank products. <laughs> Nothing was a total fail, but it was all good. I loved it. I'm glad I got to test these. These actually were pretty expensive considering the other Shark Tank products I've tested, but I mean, a good invention is a good invention. This wasn't expensive. I just had to buy it on a separate website other than Amazon, which was a little annoying, but it came pretty fast. Anyway, if there's ever any products you'd like me to test, please let me know below or on any other social media platform. I read and see everything. So subscribe to see videos every Tuesday and Thursday on this channel. Every Tuesday we test things. Every Thursday we do whatever we want. Make sure you're checking out my vlog channel and my podcast channel, my Instagram and my TikTok. I love you guys so much. And that's it. Okay, bye.